Hello everybody, welcome back to an edition of the Modicon M221 training. I'm your host, Leandro Mada, and in this video, what we're gonna see is the trace functionality that we have in the software. So let's go to the software. So in order to test this, let's create a variable that change over time. So let's create something like this. Do, 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 do. So S six, I believe is time base one going to uh, this one. So every second something's going to count up. Uh, MW zero equal percentage and W zero plus one. Okay. And let's make a comparison. So when this percentage and the view zero is higher than equal 20. Let's go back to zero. Something quick. Okay. Then what I'm going to do is create something similar. Copy run and paste run with a much faster cycle. This one's going to reach it to 100. So now, how we can make the trace? OK, so to make the trace, we need the animation table. So if we go to Tools, Animation Table, right click, Add New Animation Table. I'm going to check this to Animation Table. Uh, trace here we just need to add the variables that we're going to use so in my case i'm going to add nw0 oops my bad nw0 and mw10 i should have changed this over here too w10 10 you can imagine that this came from another device or something. Okay. Just creating a new value. Okay. So now in order to make this right, I need to show the trace. What we need is to specify here trace. Okay. And on the trace, we need to specify the time base. So if we select five seconds, we're going to lose some information here. Right, so uh, you can see that. There we go. So if you have, once you select trace, you should be able to see this trace enable uh, when you are online. So here is the time base. So how often is going to change the value? So just to make it see that doesn't work as suspected, I'm going to use this five seconds. Then I'm going to launch the simulator. Here should be able to see that this change while I know nine. You can see there is something going on over there, just changing, which is fine. Uh, now, here we have the option now to launch the trace. So here, we just need to specify to start. Uh, to maximum 100. And here you can see that every five seconds, I should be able to get this value. OK. So you can see if the time time base if I say there is a lot of information I'm missing so close I always use the lower one and the just trace it is 500 uh, 100 this was 100 yes 100 start now we should be able to see that the date that the data is coming much faster than before of course here in this case i'm going to lose information 
the time phase the time base is slower than the one that uh, how the variable is changing over time but it doesn't mean that the information is not proceed is not processed by the plc the information is there it's just the visualization is not fast enough in order than to to see it okay so the same to make it much better we can use something like this the same we can put it on 20 uh, send and trace to 0 to 20 start then you should be able to see in each second uh, how the variables are not quite good okay so the red one is the is the one that has this variable changes over one second so i would imagine that the line is going to be much better uh, but if you can see in the other one it is just taking time taking points where it changed without having the real figure so that's why it's important to have the right information coming over here so um this doesn't mean that you are not receiving the good data it's just a visualization the time base is just one second so in order to see this in much better probably would advise to have i uh, know uh, an hmi you can simulate this in an hmi so if we open operator terminal expert it's going to take more time so no we can do it later but this is just to show you the importance of, of for troubleshooting so if it's a variable that is changing over time is faster than one second okay the change you're gonna lose lose the information okay on the trace but doesn't mean that the plc is not there to process well the plc is much faster than this okay just to show you that because the cycle of the plc as you can see here the task behavior uh, is much faster okay just to mention that so uh, this is how you can use the trace inside the software of the modicon mt21 in order to debug in and see how the variables analog values change over time it can also be shown for uh, boolean variables okay in this case just to show you using uh, analog values so thank you very much for watching this video and i see you on the next one